Hi, this is Peter from the DJ Podcast with an Ableton Live tip. If you want to change the look and feel of Ableton Live's interface, consider installing a custom skin. With the custom skin file downloaded onto your computer's hard drive, open the Ableton Live application folder. On a Mac, right-click on the Ableton Live application and then select Show Package Contents. On Windows, go to the Ableton Live folder in the Program Files directory. On a Mac, you're going to want to go ahead and open up the Contents folder, and then in this folder, you'll see that there is an App Resources folder. So you're going to want to open that. If you're on Windows, you're going to want to go to the Resources folder. Here you can see that we have another directory called Skins. So I'm going to go ahead and open that up. Then I'm going to copy the custom skin file that I have downloaded on my computer over to that Skins folder. Once you copy the file over, you can then go ahead and launch Ableton Live. If you already have Live running, you're going to want to restart it. Once you have Ableton Live running, you're going to want to go ahead and open up the Preferences. So I'm going to go up to Live, then select Preferences. When you're here, you're going to want to make sure that you are on the Look and Feel tab. Underneath the Colors section, we have a drop-down menu next to the option of Skin. So I can click on that, and this will allow me to choose the new skin file that we installed. You can also choose from one of the different skins that ship with Ableton Live. Thanks for watching this Ableton Live tutorial video. If you like this video, subscribe at youtube.com slash the DJ podcast or at the DJ podcast.com.